couple of months later it is just pure chaos in this Me and Joe are obsessed with this. So embarrassed. Self a wall, it's tags on. Time it's your girl Shella. If you're new, welcome. If you're not, welcome back as always. Um, today's gonna be quite a productive day. We're tackling quite a few things. First and foremost, and the most I think main ordeal is my wardrobe. It's a small wardrobe, and there's a lot of clothes in there, and it's just very chaotic in there. It was once organized, and then one day I had to find something, and then the rummaging started. It just came to a point where I was like, oh, okay, it's fine. I'll just organize it tomorrow or when I'm next off whatever but then another day comes along you're like oh, crap I need to find my jeans for my favorite pair of jeans rummaging some more and then it's just a couple months later it is just pure chaos in there and meal prep I bought a 10 pack of meal prep containers from Amazon I just want to get more organized really <laughs> what I usually do is I just make like a big dinner and have enough for lunch the next day but I want to be more consistent just having lunch prepared especially for work and sometimes we'll make dinner and there's just not enough for lunch the next day and then we'll be buying lunch and then these trying times you know you gotta pinch where you can you gotta be more efficient in how you spend your money and how you cook and things like that so today I'm gonna do like a proper meal prep it's 11 okay we need to get cracking let's start with the dishes and cleaning the apartment first and foremost let's go take the life out of me why is it so energy consuming i'm always sweating after i hoover but that's finally done place is looking spooky span and now to tackle this bad boy as you can see it's a small wardrobe it's a, it's a very teeny tiny wardrobe and i've been squeezing too many things in there so we're gonna open it up and just i'm really sorry for what you're about to see because like i said it's pure chaos in there okay i'm so embarrassed don't judge me okay don't judge me I can barely even open it uh -huh. let's just get a closer look i guess um ta -da. um i don't really know what to do here uh -huh. okay let's just I think what I'm gonna do, I'm just literally gonna have to pull everything out. Put it back in, take out what I'm gonna donate and go from there, I guess. So, wish me luck and let's get cracking, I guess. My baby don't mess around because she loves me so. Like, what, what the hell? So, I've taken out all the stuff that I was just like literally thrown in there. But actually, if you have a look, some of it is still organized. Like, hello, can you even see that? All of these folded, hoodies like sweatshirts and t-shirts so that's been kept intact i guess everything just kind of drowned it so let's fold up the rest and oh my god this is a terrible angle i am so sorry you see that did anyone go through a like phase of buying heat sweat sets tracksuit bottoms sweat bottoms hoodies etc during the pandemic because i did i bought literally a bulk load of sweatshirts and bottoms i was like if i'm gonna stay at home for god knows how long i might as well be cute and comfy and have all these matching sets go about this top look how cute it is oh um, like what's that fabric like the slinky cute oh my gosh i've been looking for this everywhere okay that actually wasn't that bad don't look at this part i'm just not that organized to that level where it's like done by uh, jackets tops colors lengths and sleeves i'm just like it's up it's staying in place i can see it that will do <laughs> 
for a while my cat had a spot of where she would sleep and lay in in my wardrobe and this is the outcome to my best friend Jamal I am so sorry I will try my best to get all the fluff out I don't know if you want it back because the fluff is really fluffy but I will do my best to clean it out for you <laughs> the power of clothes we donated not a lot but I even have things, this is what I mean why I'm saying I want to get away from fast fashion and just things that are like very just I'm looking at it now and I'm like, oh, this just looks so tacky <laughs> Why do I even go for this? Like I've got this blinky cow's neck bodysuit And I'm just like, when am I ever going to wear this? And I got it in brown as well So I haven't worn it, tags on, it's been like, I think it's been a year This bright orange skirt To be fair, I did get quite a lot of wear out of this when I was in Australia Many moons ago, because it was actually sunny all the time So this was my going out in the day but still cute skirt but i'm past that phase that's it all that's left is to meal prep before we do that i am so hungry i need to make i need to have lunch i need to eat something i need to have an ice latte so let's do that first because i need more I need Don't judge me, I know it wasn't the most healthy, but I was hungry and it's a quick estate. See, this is why meal prepping needs to be more of a thing in my life because then I end up getting lazy to cook and I'm having instant noodles and pita bread and taramasalata. salata. Do not go lie, it was delicious, okay? So don't come for me. So yeah, for the next two days for lunch, I'm gonna make these. Me and Joe are obsessed with these, the spinach and ricotta tortellonis. So two packs of those I'm gonna make and then portion it out so it should last for two days for lunch. Some spinach and on the side, broccoli and I have um, leftover frozen car carrots so I was like, might as well use that. And yeah, put some peppers in and red pesto. Okay, so that is the meal prep done for the next two days for our lunches. So we did a lot today, a very productive day, we tidied the flat, that's the usual thing. Meal prepped and we finally organised my bloody wardrobe, which wasn't as bad and as chaotic, I mean no. The wardrobe cupboard section was actually quite a mess. We finally took the time to fold it up and take out all the ones that I don't wear anymore, that I don't want anymore. But yeah. I think I'm gonna leave the video here. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I hope you got some inspo in having a productive day. Got some inspo for maybe meal prepping or for sorting out that wardrobe that you've been meaning to sort out or whatever it is that you've been meaning to sort out and declutter. Stop holding it off because it's just gonna get worse and worse and worse. I left mine for way too long. <laughs> but yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this one and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye.